When meat processing plants slowed production during the pandemic, many farmers had to turn to local butcher shops to process their livestock. Well, Carter Schmidt shares the story of one shop that's now thriving off of the demand. On the South Dakota-Iowa state line just east of Sioux Falls, you'll find Borderline Butchering, a new butcher shop opened by Ron Heller of Brandon. Heller is a 20-year Air Force veteran but grew up on a farm and has always been an avid hunter and fisherman. I started doing a lot of uh, deer and other things probably most of my life and then probably within the last three to five years really started getting into the livestock doing hogs and, and then into the beef. Opening a butcher shop is something Heller had in mind for quite a while and Borderline Butchering opened its doors in November of 2021. We were trying to open a lot sooner but it's just uh, a lot of stuff to do to get started and uh, so yeah about seven months now. To build the business, Heller had to find land first. We had wrote letters to some of the farmers in the area and uh, Dick Funky reached out and contacted me. And being a fellow veteran, I thought, you know what, I think I can work with this guy. He seems like a good guy. So um, we drove around the area and he found this little chunk of land and says, I'd really like to locate right here, Dick. Could you help me out? The Funky sold Heller a few acres of land about a mile south of their cattle farm near Rowena saying everyone benefits from more local butchers. The producer benefits, the butcher shop benefits, and the customer benefits from lower prices. Joe Funky works this cattle operation with his dad. We read out, reach out, book a date with Ron, um, and then basically that, that uh, consumer can basically book a quarter to a half cow, quarter cow, whole cow if they want, um, and then they kind of pay us and then pay Ron individually. Um, and. and that's how it works, and then it's basically that farm-to-table approach. With many butcher shops backed up with appointments, Dick Funky says it was up to a two-year wait to get an animal butchered. We've reduced that time probably to, what, three months? But after less than a year in business, Heller's schedule is already filling up. We're booked almost to the end of 22. We're looking at uh, increasing our production. Once we are able to increase our production, then uh, the books will open up again, so we're hoping to be able to do about twice what we're doing now. Right now, Heller's focus is mainly on hogs and beef, even though he sees interest from hunters. A lot of people come to the door or even make a phone call and ask us if we can do wild game, and uh, we're looking to possibly do that. We just have to see where we're sitting uh, this fall around hunting season. Heller says he's busy enough the way it is. Everything gets cut up on the solve and put on the tables, and our workers will cut the beef up and we'll package it. From there it goes to the freezer. It's usually about minus 10 in here. And then to the smoking room. We got a couple smokers here that we run so we can get quite a bit of product in there. Whether it's jerky, steak, brats, or patties, it all takes a lot of time and energy before it's ready for customers. It's the quality. Yeah, it's, it's fantastic. I think that the fact that he's able to get meat processed. He can package exactly how you want it, cut however you want it. He has the ability to smoke, dry age. It's, it's the whole deal. Ron just does an excellent job. He'll cut it the way you want it, not the way they do it. We need more small businesses. Even though starting his own butcher shop has been a lot of work. Thank you, Chris. Heller is excited about the future. I asked him what he's looking forward to most going forward. <laughs> Maybe taking a break and not working weekends, but uh, no, I look forward to my biggest thing that I enjoy about this business is probably the customers, the people that come through the door, meeting a lot of the farmers in local areas and, and just some great people that come through who are great customers.